All right, hello and welcome. I hope everyone's staying safe out there, practicing social distancing, washing your hands. So we are here, uh, as if you saw the video on Friday, for the first matchup for our collections bracket challenge or tournament, whatever we're deciding to call it. So our first matchup today is, uh, we have a photo from the Palm Sunday Tornadoes versus the auction sale of Emma Schrock. So, Instead of just voting on these, we decided it would probably be a good idea to give you some information. So, and also so you can see the physical objects themselves. So I have them both in front of me. And how this is going to work is we're going to post this video today. Today's Monday. And then the next video will be posted on Wednesday. So you'll have up until when the next video posts to vote, we're going to create a poll uh, with our Facebook post. So you'll be able to vote right underneath this video. And when the next video post, we'll announce the winner and see who's moving on. So it, to give you some background information, we're going to look at these matchups. I'm going to give you some information about the objects themselves and the story that they tell. And that way you'll be able to vote for out of these two, which one's your favorite and which one will move on in the tournament. So first, let's look at the photo of the Palm Sunday tornado. So this particular scene is from the Midway Mobile Home Park, which is uh, today in the Dunlap area. So April 11th, 1965, uh, a number of tornadoes went through the Midwest, 47 tornadoes in total. Elkhart County was hit by four tornadoes and was actually the most concentrated area of damage in the Midwest. Uh, four tornadoes rated at the F4 level, which is anywhere up to wind speeds of 260 miles an hour, went through Elkhart County. Um, in total, uh, in the photo here, this is the Midway Mobile Home Park. Over 190 mobile homes were destroyed. Uh, one tornado passed through the court, uh, through the trailer court. And in this background of the photo, you can see another tornado making its way towards the towards the park. So, in total, other than the 190 mobile homes that were destroyed that day, over 300 houses were destroyed in Elkhart County. 1,400 people were displaced, many people were injured, and over 60 people were killed from their injuries during this day on the Palm Sunday tornadoes. Uh, and 55 years later, it still remains a moment that is ingrained in the minds of many people who live through it. Uh, we still get many people who visit the museum uh, that tell us about what they lived through during that day. So that's the one, uh, one item that we're gonna have, and it's gonna go up against this painting. This painting is, no, is the, titled The Auction Sale, and the artist is Emma Schrock. Emma Schrock lived in Wakarusa. She was born in 1924. She died in 1991. Uh, she, what was interesting about her is she didn't start painting until she was 40 years old. And Emma Schrock needed to come, uh, overcome a number of challenges to become an artist. First being her, her faith. She was a member of the Old Order Mennonite community, which actually forbids the depiction of human form. So, but Emma was allowed to paint uh, and create these scenes in order to make a living. Uh, the other thing that she had to overcome is uh, she was physically disabled. Uh, so she was unable to do a number of different types of work and she turned to artistry to help make her make a living. So she had to get uh, permission from her faith community and overcome her disability to paint. Uh, when she did start painting, she was actually pretty prolific. Uh, she has over two, uh, what is believed to be over 2,000 art pieces and was said to, when she would start a painting, com uh, complete most of her paintings in a single day. Uh, the subjects of her paintings, like this one here, uh, are things from her childhood memories or, and, and or the experience of the Amish and Mennonite community that she saw around her. So she basically painted what she lived and lived what she painted. Uh, and that was actually a famous quote that she talked about when she was talking about the subjects of her paintings. So uh, that's our matchup for today. So we have the Palm Sunday Tornado versus the Emma Schrock painting. So as I said before, we're going to post this video today on Monday. You're going to have about four, two days to vote. We'll create a poll right underneath this. Vote for which one you want to see move on. And then on Wednesday, we'll announce the winner and see who's going to move on in our bracket and introduce the next two items that are gonna be matching up against each other. So cast your vote, think wisely, place your bets, and we'll see which moves on in the tournament. So that's it for now. Stay safe, everyone.